Welcome back to Afternoon Break. It's National Law Enforcement Day, so what better day to introduce you to the Savannah Police Department's new addition to their firmly. That's right, Goose, a Labrador puppy, has been in training with the department's behavioral health unit, and we're about to make your day so much better because he and Corporal Julie Cavanaugh join us today right here. Goose, now he got his name from the film Top Gun, yes. which is so fitting because he's going to be your guys's co-pilot co-pilot you guys i just need to have a minute right now this is goose you gotta look at look at all the people goose can i pick him up yeah <gasps> Absolutely. oh my gosh okay so i'm gonna i'm gonna <laughs> just you know not be productive at all in this moment now he explain to us he's a therapy dog he so will be a therapy he will dog. be a ther so he's in yes. training right now oh you want to yes. get down okay okay um he's a therapy dog what is the difference between a therapy dog and a canine dog what does that training look like um so a therapy dog he's going to be trained to be extremely calm in situations um be able to provide comfort to anyone in need police officers or people from the local community mm -hmm. And it, he'll be willing to accept pets. Um, if he's standing up and somebody leans on him, he'll be trained to stand still and take the pressure um, and not move. Okay. Now, what does this training look like? What's his schedule like? Is he able to interact? I mean, in terms of people at the station, can he interact with anybody? Is there limitations? So up until this week, um, we were doing socialization. So he was going out places, mm -hmm. meeting everyone, meeting all the officers, going to all the training. Um, and now we're going in more into the obedience portion. Mm -hmm. So he will... I'll work with him in 10 to 15 minute increments throughout the day and every Thursday at 2 the trainer comes in yeah. and we work on things and of course I get homework. Because um, yeah. you were, let's remind everybody, you're his handler. Yes. So explain kind of what that is for those who don't know. Um, so Goose essentially goes home with me every day, gets up in the morning, comes to work with me. Um, we work on training throughout the day, we'll have short training sessions and then we get ready to go home again. What does he know how to do so far? Um, so we sit and down and we're working on stay and recalls. Oh my goodness, he loves treats. Yes. Let's, let's show everybody one, one trick. Sit. Yes. Ah. Good, job. good job. So good. Will he be doing community events? Yes, he will. Okay, so what does that look like again? Because with therapy dogs, I mean, there is a little bit of strict energy, right? I mean, they can't interact with just everybody or, or right. So is when that we free? go, when we go in to an environment, mm -hmm. um, I'll wait till it gets extremely calm once he gets certified. Right. Um, and once everything is calmed down and he's, he's had a, a time to kind of see the room, mm -hmm. um, then he'll be allowed to interact with people. Um, last Friday we went to KB Williams elementary school and we mm -hmm. visited four first grade classrooms. Um, that was his first time interacting yeah. with, with groups of kids that size. He did great, um, no problems yet, and we look forward to doing more in the future. So with therapy dogs, they sense distress, is yes. my understanding. So when you're training them, how are you implementing those uh, cues, if you will, for them to be able to, to discern that? So once he um, finishes training, mm -hmm. like um, one of his cues will be go say hi or make a new friend, and mm -hmm. that will be him coming and, and introducing himself to someone. Goose, are you having so much fun on live TV? <laughs> I just love him so much. You guys, thank you so much for bringing him. Not a problem. Thank you for training him. You guys, do not go anywhere because we have a special treat for you. Goose will be choosing the championship of tonight's game. Stick around. That's coming up right after the break.